Good evening, it's your man Earl. www.juiceswild22.com www.figtreeglobal.com We are here at the house uh, about sundown Saturday, the 29th of September and I apologize for the uh, It's just interesting, and today's subject matter is end, end game strategies. And the reason for that is uh, we have been notified. Uh, we didn't want to make a huge announcement, of course, uh, but we have been notified that uh, the hospital is wanting to, not wanting to, going to take my mother off. Uh, one of the quote-unquote life support devices that she's on uh, tomorrow at approximately 2 p.m. So, with that in mind, uh, we try to be relative here. We try to be uh, real. We try to tell people that life is for real. So today's subject matter is end game strategies and not kind of what you think it is. You know, whenever you do research on end game strategies, whether it be business or personal, a lot of examples come up with chess. And so I just want to use this as a subject matter tonight. Once again, day 272. Today is September 29th on the calendar. Uh, end game strategies. Here we go. Uh, you have to be familiar with life. You have to be familiar with what you want to get accomplished. You want to be. You have to be familiar. What's important to you, and and if you want to relate that to, if you want to relate that to, uh, to chess, if you will. You know, there's 16 pieces on the chessboard. You know, eight pawns. Uh, rooks, uh, one king, uh, one queen, and the pieces are called, they're called chessmen, and the chess board is, is finite, and what do I mean by that is, is in life, uh, there are sometimes there's only a certain amount of moves that you could make. And if you if you want to put together an end game strategy, you you need to be familiar with how to make those moves. You know, tomorrow I have no idea what, what life is going to hold for myself and my family, my children. You know, potentially tomorrow we could we could be quote unquote, you know, my mom could leave us tomorrow. We, I have no idea. And so I'm, I'm moving forward, yes, because life doesn't stop. Nevertheless, it could easily uh, not be that. We, we don't know. And so we, we still have to engage in end game. We have to plan ahead the best we can. So I encourage you today, do you have a will? You know, do you have a plan? I have five children, and I have to admit, I don't. I don't have a will. I don't have uh, any kind of directives in place. And you know, I told myself my birthday is next month. I said, you know what? I'm I'm going to get my house all the way in order uh, because I have no idea what life holds. It, my life could be utterly changed tomorrow. My family's life could be changed tomorrow. My my kids, their grandmother could be gone tomorrow. We have no idea. But that doesn't stop us, <clears throat> excuse me, that doesn't stop us from your strategies. So day 272, in game strategies, be familiar with the game of life. What are the pieces in the game of life? I'm talking about insurance. I'm talking about a will. I'm talking about a plan for your family if something happens to you. Those are the pieces of life. If you want to compare it to a chessboard. 
And guess what? Each of those pieces can make certain moves for you, just like chess. A king can do so much. A queen can do so much. A pawn can do so much. A rook can do so much. And you have to be familiar with those pieces. Life is not infinite. So day 272. September 29th. Saturday evening. Uh, yeah. Shaman Earl, God bless you. Uh, www.deucewild22.com. Day 272 end game strategies. Peace.